Several years ago, I just had three small children at the time. My husband came home from work and there was burned macaroni and cheese on the stove for dinner. And I was sitting on the couch with a mountain of laundry taller than me, trying to fold through this. I, I swear you were peeking into my house. <laughs> <laughs> I hope that more people understand this image yeah. than just me. Okay, <laughs> so my husband came home to find me this way and I tried to put on the martyr's face, right? I'm fine, I'm, I'm good, I'm okay. <laughs> and he recognized immediately that I really wasn't okay. So he brought me my car keys and my scriptures and he said, go take a drive to the temple. And That's I a said, good husband. It was I'm, a good I'm husband. I'm taking notes right now. <laughs> <laughs> and he was right, I needed a minute with God. So I drove over to the temple and I walked around to the back of the temple and there was no one there and I found a bench that had a light by it and I held my scriptures and the stars were out and I felt so small. I felt like there's so many stars and there are so many people. There's no way that God knows who I am. All I do is fold laundry and burn macaroni and cheese, right? That's all I do with my life. And I had my scriptures and I, I wanted something. I wanted to find something that would teach me that I had value, that he could see me, but I didn't know where to go. So I did that tried and true method of flip and point. And I flipped and pointed a couple times. And then the third time that I flipped and pointed, I landed in Alma chapter 26. And it says, now we see that God is mindful of every people, whatsoever land they may be in. Yea, he numbereth his people and his bowels of mercy are over all the earth. This is my joy and my great thanksgiving. Now you might read that scripture and think, well, it doesn't sound very nice to be a number. Mm -hmm. But I understood instantly through the spirit that the same way I know my children, I know Caleb is my oldest and I can tell you all about him and Shasti is next and all the way down to number six. I know which number they are. I know their birthdays. I know what their favorite ice cream flavor is, right? I can tell you all about them. And I knew in that moment, Heavenly Father knew which number I was. I'm number eight trillion, whatever number child of his. He knows my name. He knows everything about me. And through the spirit, this beautiful warmth washed over me and I knew that I had value to my Heavenly Father.